Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to some Monster Jam Steel Titans here on the channel. Today guys, we have finally received our first piece of DLC for this game. The first piece of downloadable content. So, if you guys go check out the store right now, there is a fire and ice truck pack available. This truck pack is, I believe, let me look here, $5.29. $5.30 Canadian, so I don't know what that is everywhere else in the world. US dollars. It's probably less. Actually, I know it's less because the Canadian dollar sucks. But for like five dollars, you're able to actually pick up this pack and it has 12 cars within it. These 12 cars are a mixture of real designs and toy designs for monster trucks. So it's pretty cool. There are the ice themed trucks and the fire themed trucks to bring it all together and make for a cool DLC pack. So today we're going to be talking about that. We're going to take a look at the different trucks like Gravedigger, El Toro Loco, Max D, and a few others. We're going to have some fun with it. That's what we're doing today, guys. Let's get right in to the gameplay. Okay guys, so here we go. We are loaded in to the game. I've purchased the pack. Like I said, for like $5, you can go ahead and purchase 12 trucks for this game. It's crazy. I'm going to go ahead and talk about the 12 different trucks right here, right now. If you guys do enjoy, make sure to smash that thumbs up button for me. Throw any comments down below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Join the Goon Army, guys. We are on the road to 10k. Follow me on Instagram at Goonzig Productions. If you just type in Goonzig, it should come up. You should be able to find me. Same with on Twitter, Facebook, pretty much every social media. Type in Goonzig and it should come up. Check out the Ones Company link in the description guys oppose nothing conquer everything grab your merch and all right here we go let's start talking about the fire and ice pack so I'm gonna go ahead and just show you guys every single truck that comes with the pack and then I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some gameplay with some of the trucks as well so to start things off we have dragon ice this is the first truck and there are actually two themes to the trucks within this pack obviously fire and ice so this one is the ice theme and then we have el toro loco ice as well which i mean it's pretty cool to see it in like a totally different form usually it's like red and almost like fiery and now it's frozen and icy and it looks pretty sweet now moving on from there grave digger is actually i believe the only one that we get both versions for so this is grave digger fire obviously it's on fire and then we have a grave digger ice as well moving on from there we have great clips mohawk warrior fire edition and yeah it does look like we actually do not get any other duplicate trucks so grave digger is the only one that gets a fire and an ice and then mohawk warrior fire max d we get the fire max d look at that thing that thing looks mean man oh dude now moving on from there we have megalodon and i would have figured that they made megalodon the ice version but they went ahead switched it up and made it the fire version and i think it looks amazing just really really cool i do think that if they went ahead and made it the ice version then it would kind of look fairly similar to what the truck actually is so seeing megalodon like this man he's my rival right now in our career series which i'm gonna finish that guys don't you worry i'm just taking a little break from it but it will be back but i know what megalodon looks like so to see him looking like this oh man i would i would be shook if I, if I had to line up beside this thing, like, holy. We have the ice version of Monster Mutt, and I, I should go ahead and see if I can still go ahead and do our little cheat for the freestyle events. Pop it into a wheelie and just sit on that back end. That would kind of show that the trucks are designed the same. I'm assuming they just reskinned the trucks. They're not gonna go ahead and remodel everything just to do this pack. It's probably just a reskin. So moving on from there, Soldier of Fortune. And this is one that I've actually never used. I don't think I have ever used this truck. To see it like this, it looks like it's ready to go on like, an arctic mission man i love it oh that's awesome that is too cool and that rounds out the real trucks the real truck designs in this pack moving on from there we get two 
toy car designs. I'm assuming, uh, I actually don't even know, maybe Monster Jam makes toy cars and these are two designs that they sell. I'm not too sure where these two cars come from, but we have Wildfire. Look at this. I don't know if they just designed it for this game or what, but it's like an eagle. We got, I mean, the eagle head, the feet, the wings, man unreal this thing looks gnarly and then for the ice side of things we have the yeti and it says beware yeti seen in area which is pretty funny because i mean get it it's a yeti <laughs> yeah look at that face man i don't know if i'd want to take that thing on i don't even know if i'd want to drive this truck man that thing is ugly. Now I thought that was the last truck, but we also have zombie fire. So I'm pretty sure this is just the zombie truck done up in a fire edition. And look at it. This one might actually be one of the coolest ones. It has like arms coming off of it. Maybe this isn't an actual truck. Nah, there's totally a zombie, right? Oh, okay. You know what? Zombie actually normally has arms and stuff coming off of it. Okay. That makes sense. And then zombie fire just looks like this. Man, the truck trucks really come to life in this pack like they look unreal five dollars for this i think it's definitely worth it if you're like me and you haven't actually purchased a lot of trucks with the in-game currency and you're a broke boy in game then definitely go ahead and pick up this pack but now let's go ahead and see if we can get a little sketchy here throw on the headset and who should i be who should i start things off as i don't even know i kind of want to do both grave diggers just to kind of compare them both i'm always grave digger though uh ah, ah, man this is a tough decision 12 new trucks all right so i'm not going to do anything too crazy we're just going to kind of cruise around the monster jam university look at this truck man this is grave digger fire the thing is literally on fire there's actually like particle effects coming off of the truck our tire paths like the the deformation is like leaving i don't even know is it supposed to be like the dust that's being turned up or what but it's like flames this looks man this looks absolutely amazing and then i'm assuming ice is pretty much the same thing but just I mean a frozen version so guys keep in mind these trucks are not updated updated upgraded I haven't upgraded these trucks at all so this is how they come this is how fast they go not very fast at all trucks the stock trucks are pretty slow but this is sweet of course I mean like I said the deformation where the tires are going or like the tire path it's coming off as like a frozen vibe this time it's not on fire this is unreal I feel like I have to check out wildfire right wildfire I feel like what they did is there are 10 real trucks and then they went ahead and added in kind of one unique design for fire and then one unique design for the ice trucks so i think that's pretty cool yeah i i could be i don't even know what i just tried to say there but i could be wrong i could be 100 percent wrong and maybe this is a real truck but if we come in here and look we have one two three four five six seven eight nine 10 real trucks and then yeti and wildfire are the made up ones so i think we got it boys i think we got it this truck is definitely kind of based off of the fire theme this thing man i want to see if we can break a wing off that's my goal like i kind of want to see if like i can break it in a certain way because yes the truck it looks amazing but how does it how does it break down? How does it stand up to some damage? I need some gnarly jumps or something. It's too hard to actually like flip my truck. Oh, there we go. There we go, but nothing happened. I actually don't even know if I can take damage within Monster Jam University. I might not be able to. I actually don't know if we can. Let's just see if like maybe hit a jump here and maybe try and like mess up, land on like the roof and just like crunch the truck if anything happens no nothing's gonna happen i don't think we can damage our trucks here in uh the university that's weird now yeti is of course the ice version for the unique trucks if that makes sense look at this thing man oh it looks awesome the tires like glow i think that's the coolest part is like the tires and the effects that the tires give off because 
Man, visuals go a long way. And the bright popping colors, even on like the fire, the fire cars, the fire trucks, the fire trucks. Oh yeah, man, we're driving some fire trucks. Man, that could be some clickbait right there. Oh man, idea sparked. So it actually does look like we can take damage. I just don't think, I don't think I rolled wildfire enough to take enough damage or any damage. Oh. I got a collectible and now my truck's like fixed? Interesting. I don't know if you guys saw it. I did have like a flap of hair hanging off of this car, but now it seems to be fixed. So I don't know what happened there. All right, Monster Mutt Ice Edition. And you guys know, you guys already know what we're gonna put to the test now. I wanna actually put in a decent bit of a run and then I wanna see if our wheelie technique kind of stands true for uh, this version of Monster Mutt. Man, I really need to work on using uh, double stick steering because I do not use it and I have it enabled and like it is so hard to turn only using the one stick. And you guys tell me in every video and I feel bad because it's not like I don't know. Like I know I don't use double stick steering and I know I should be using it. It's just I completely forget and I do want to get used to it, it's just, man, I cannot remember. But it is useful, I think it is a very useful thing to use, and once I get it, man, once I get the hang of that dual stick steering, we are gonna be, oh, we're gonna be a threat here in Monster Jam, but until then, we're just gonna goon it up. We're actually doing killer right now, like, let's go. Can I keep the combo alive? Oh, man. We are doing awesome. Nine times combo. That's the second time I have ever seen that. We've already won the event with 30 seconds left, 40 seconds. We are on the Steel Titans difficulty, so... Man, maybe the ice trucks are good luck. Is that is that a thing? That might be a thing. Who knows? Now, in order to test my trick, we need to wheelie the truck, and I cannot, I cannot get it up into a wheelie. I cannot do it, but hey, at least we won our first event as a DLC truck. I can't complain about that. All right, here we go. Put it to the true test. My truck just doesn't have the upgrades to wheelie. That's the main issue right now. Like, I do not have the power to bust out a wheelie. So, um, how could we do this? How can I get into a smooth wheelie? Maybe like that. Oh, that might work. We might be able to do it just like that, but I don't know. All right, I changed my truck a little bit. I still don't think we have the power to wheelie. Nah, man, we need to upgrade this bad boy and we will put it to the test in a future video because it just doesn't have the power which is kind of crazy like a full out monster truck does not have the power to wheelie all right it's not fully upgraded but we can end it here guys i think this was a good little showcase showing off some of the cars within this pack or the trucks within this pack if you guys did enjoy make sure to smash that thumbs up button let me know in the comments below which truck is your favorite let me know in the comments below the trucks are looking good i think definitely worth five dollars i don't know maybe it's just me let me know your thoughts down below in the comments subscribe if you are new i will catch you guys in another video peace out